Hi everyone, Joe for Jaspi's CaseBreaks.com with a box of Capstone Baseball. It's a random team break, number 41. The last filler we got to do to unlock this break that's coming up in the next video. Eight spots being given away in, um, in this break, ladies and gentlemen. Big thanks to this group for making it happen. Appreciate it. All teams are in. We got another play-in game in basketball coming down to the wire. We're going to randomize names and teams three and a five, eight times. Different dice roll for the giveaway part, as, as most of you know by now. Names first. Pelican's ball. Thunder up by one. Pelicans have a lot of time. They don't have to rush. Turnaround jumper for Brandon Ingram. Off the back of the rim. Thunder rebound. 15 seconds left. They're up by one. They're not fouling. They're not fouling. What were they doing? Jason Jasper, what were they doing? That, that there was no time left in the game? It's a one-point game. They were just going to let him run out the clock? There's three and a five, eight times for the teams. Josh Giddy hitting clutch free throws here. No one, no one was, uh, no, no one's letting Josh Giddy's get dust on him, right? No need to even dust off. Hits the second free throw. Twelve seconds. Pelicans up by three. Oof. It's exciting. Exciting, ladies and gentlemen. Getting that playoff fever. All right, let's do this break really quick. All right, here's the first half of the list right there. No trade windows, as you know by now. And filler breaks, there's second half right there. Let's sort by column A. Let's print and rip. I mean... You look at the Pelicans and you think, if, if they lose by like a possession or two, you got to think, how much would have Zion helped? You know, if, if the Thunder lose by a possession or two, you know, so like you would think, man, how much would have Chet Holmgren would have helped in that game? Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, not a playoff game. It's a play in fever. The most, what, the most exciting three or four days of the year. The NBA play-in. This is kind of, it kind of gives you March Madness sort of feels. The Thunder are not out of the woods yet. Timeout advances the ball. Let's... All right, here we go. No. Quick foul. Yeah. James, I think you're right. Brandon Ingram and McCollum should be enough. Got Valanciunas as well. They got so they got some players. Wow. Brandon Ingram misses the free throw. Taylor Ward for the Angels. That will be for Kevin. 
Do you see? I don't know. I think Nancy's a Pelicans fan. I wonder what she would say. Do you think she would say trade Zion? Just get. I mean, you're, they're basically playing without Zion. <laughs> anyway, was Greg Deekman? Do you hold out hope that you that that the stars align and? The Pelicans go on a deep playoff run. That one season, Zion is like fully healthy. Or do you trade him, see if you can get a big call for him, and then tr just draft the next Zion? I guess. There's Jose Morata. I. But I mean, is there a next Zion? I don't know. It's Jose Miranda for the Twins. That goes to James O. But then are you even going to get a haul for Zion? Who's going to give you a haul for Zion? There's Vlad75. Somewhat ironically, it's the Thunder who actually have... Don't, aren't, don't the Thunder hold like a zillion picks? And they, they could burn some in a trade? Here's a Wander Franco for the Red Hot Rays. Ooh, blocked. Yeah, what do you do when he says he's healthy but won't play until he wins? Spencer Torkelson, he's on my fantasy team. He's hitting a little bit better. He's starting to heat up a little bit. Yeah, I don't know what you say, although the team doctors apparently, according to the broadcast, said that he wasn't medically cleared to play yet. But... I don't know. I get what he's saying, though. It's like, hey, listen, until I can give the team, you know, the best version of myself, I don't want to be a a burden to the team. But it's but it's not like Zion's like the sixth man. Like, 70% of Zion is still many percent better than half, probably maybe half the guys on this court. So some, I don't know why, why like, management should just be like, listen, 70% of you is better than 0% of, you know. I would at least try to be like, hey, can you give us 15 a night? Wow. All right, let's flip back over here. Oh, I don't want to upload that video yet. I need a giveaway. This basketball game's distracting me here. All right, let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Four and a five, nine times. So it's going to be the top eight after nine. You'll be in the next break, the diamond dozen. Good luck. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. After nine. Now from nine through thirty, it is gonna be sad times. Carlos. Sorry man, very close, but just not quite. Nine through thirty, thank you everyone for giving it a shot. Top eight though, happy times for James, Danny, James again, Eric, Nestor, Michael, Danny, Chad. So congrats to the top eight after nine. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'll see you in the next video for the Jaspies, the Diamond Dozen. Bye-bye.